You know, the one thing about Antonio, he always looks good when he's out there. Uh, he went through, uh, you know, part of practice, and uh, you know, we, again, we're going to go day day to day, and hopefully, he doesn't have a setback and he's able to practice on Wednesday. I, I'm just excited to have him out practicing. Uh, you know, as I say, when he when he's can practice, he looks good, and and I'm hopeful he can play. Uh, but I, I don't want to put that burden on him or on on us in terms of. Uh, seeing how he get, how he feels. Uh, you know, hopefully tomorrow there's no soreness and he can practice Wednesday. And then if he can do that, we're one day closer to him playing. Well, there's a lot of uh, different things. And, and obviously, when you have the extra days, you can focus in uh, more specifically. Uh, so we worked some on uh, the Jets blitz package, which is, is very uh, good and complicated. And, and they are uh, very good at how they do it. Uh, we worked on our run game. We worked some on the red zone. It was good. Uh, we're making progress uh, one day at a time has been our motto uh, since I've been dealing with this issue. Uh, so I was just excited about being out there today and, and just taking full and steps in the right direction. It, it's just tricky, man. It, it's just a tricky deal. Uh, the the planner is, is so tricky because practice is still controlled in a sense where I just kind of allow myself to do as much as I can as long as I controlled it without testing it, truly testing it. Uh, sometime this week, I might give it a true test of whether or not I'm going to play Sunday or not. Uh, that's just not a decision that I will make. Uh, apparently, coaches and trainers, uh, collectively, we make that decision as a committee whether or not I'm, I'm good to play on Sunday. What are the Jets, uh, what kind of problems do the Jets bring to you offensively and LT specifically? Um, obviously, you know, uh, the receiving core that they have is, uh, is, is a great receiving core. You know, and uh, when Mark Sanchez gets going, he he, he can uh, he can do some damage. And you know, we saw that in the '09 uh, playoff game where where he hit some big passes. And uh, and you know, um, the the thing that they they do well is you know they know their offense and they 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 will stick with what they're doing and what they're good at is pounding the ball. Yeah, you know, we've been trying to everybody's trying to get healthy, but um, hopefully we get everybody on the field and see if we can put it together. Their blitz package. They bring a lot of guys at a lot of different yeah. angles. And what, as, as a running back, what do you need to do? What are you looking for? Just focus in and um, keep keep my rules and uh, listen to what what Nick is telling me and Phillips is telling me and trying to um, focus and see where where the blitzes are coming from. They got so many different packages that I got to study for and be ready for it. So.